Scene opens in Team Dark's hideout. Rouge has just called a team meeting and is waiting for the crew to come inside. Shadow enters first and looks exhausted. Morning, sweetie. How are you holding up? Shadow grunts in reply and slumps down in his seat. <sighs> I know that mission was an all-nighter. When did you get back? An hour ago. Oh dear. Maybe you should go back to sleep then. Not tired. Rouge looks at him with disbelief, and then Omega walks in. Good morning, Rouge. You called for a meeting? Why, yes I did. And now that you're both here, I can tell you all about it. Shadow rolls his eyes. The mission is... To spend quality time together! Oh. Yay! Yeah, I'm going back to sleep. I thought you weren't tired! Come on, Shadow. Just a few hours? I'll give you two. Perfect! Now sit back down. I have breakfast made. Yay! Breakfast from Rouge is the best kind! Rouge giggles as she grabs the prepared meals. <laughs> she puts a plate and drink down for each of them, except Omega, who just receives a drink. Rouge sat down expectantly as Shadow reluctantly returned. Omega, I made you your special drink, just the way you'd like it. Thank you. Whoa, this flavor has not yet been registered. Omega's eyes glow as he looks to be in a daze. Shadow notices this abnormal reaction. What did you give him this time? Rouge is offended he wouldn't trust her with this, but she had experimented with it in the past. <sighs> Nothing out of the ordinary. I'm not sure why he's reacting that way. Okay, so he doesn't know this, but it's actually just oil. It's not a special drink. Mm. The crew continues the meal with few words passing between them. Shadow then reaches for his black coffee and takes a sip. Ah, Rouge, what's in this? What do you mean? It's just plain coffee. Take a look. Rouge picks up the cup and brings it to her nose. Her eyebrows immediately scrunch at the strange scent. Suddenly, realization hits her. She slams the cup down in shock and panic. Oh, I accidentally mixed up your drinks! Uh, uh, Omega, honey, how are you feeling? System failure imminent. Ah, what do we do? Turn him off before it gets worse. Rouge rushes to the panel behind Omega and begins to open it. When he starts malfunctioning, his arms begin spinning and flailing around. Error, error, error. Core burning, core burning, unstable processing unit. Rouge gets knocked back by his arms and Shadow rushes in and gets kicked by his leg. The two then charge at Omega. Shadow pins him down as Rouge turns him off. Error, error, core burning, core burning. We have to take him to Tails. Shadow nods and takes out a Chaos Emerald. Chaos Control! The three are transported with a green aura into Tails' workshop. He is working on his airplane when he notices their arrival. Ah! He jumps up, hitting his head on the bottom of the tornado. Ow! Oh, what? What are you guys doing here? We need your help to repair Omega. I accidentally gave him black coffee and- Wait, wait, wait. You gave him coffee? <laughs> uh, yes, and completely fried his system. We need your help. Okay, okay, I'll take a look. Tails picks up his toolbox and walks over to Omega and Shadow. He then opens up the stomach cavity, allowing steaming coffee to spill out. Uh, that's not good. Can you fix him? Tails pokes around for a bit and cleans out all of the coffee before responding. It's complicated. What do you mean by that? I can fix everything except the core processor. And unfortunately, that missing piece is an Eggman exclusive design. I wouldn't know how to replicate it. Rouge's expression falls. She feels guilty for Omega and desperate to save him. <laughs> then we will just have to take him to the doctor. 
Rouge, we can't just jump into things. We have to have a plan. Yeah, this is Eggman we're talking about. Yeah, and I'm a skilled assassin, and he's the freaking ultimate life form. We can take a little pushback in order to save our friend. Rouge walks up to the group and crosses her arms. Fine. We will head there as soon as possible. I'll fix what I can. Time passes, and Omega is finally ready to go. Okay. So, I put a temporary power source in him so he can check my progress. Tails then looks sheepish as he flicks Omega on. However, this temporary power is limited. He won't be able to run at maximum capacity and may act, well, under the weather. Shadow? Rouge? The two look at him with surprise and hope as he talked coherently. Egg salad train station. Sonic? Uh -huh. Maybe this will help. Shadow looks at him with disbelief, but Omega stops talking and seems to reorient. Why was I offline? Shadow can't believe that worked. Rouge is about to answer when Omega butts in. Er, 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 coaster, cantaloupe, starfish. Tails hastily turns him off. I sometimes use Rouge's lipstick. <clears throat> well, at least we know he works. <laughs> Your assistance is appreciated. We will be on our way now. Rouge gives Tails a kiss on the forehead. Thanks, Shug. The two then reunite next to Omega and teleport outside Eggman's base. Shadow goes up to the door and hits the speaker button. Ultimate life form requesting entry. It was silent for a moment as they waited for a response, when suddenly the door opened, revealing three large robots. The bots grabbed them and took them inside. Shadow and Rouge played along. When they made it to Eggman, he glared at them menacingly. He appears Omega's out of commission, so you've come crying to me for help? We are simply asking for your assistance. Yes, we need a replacement core for Omega. Or at least, the instructions to repair him ourselves. Eggman shook his head and cackled. <laughs> Who would have thought? The two of you at my mercy for the sake of this old bannock. Absolutely pathetic. I expected more from you, Shadow. <laughs> you, however... Don't surprise me in the slightest. <laughs> you going soft, Shadow? He smirked evilly at him, which caused Shadow to burn with rage. Shadow then grabbed him by the throat, lifting him in the air. The only person going soft here is you. When is the last time you actually beat us, hmm? That's what I thought. Now give us the part or I'll destroy this place. <sighs> you don't have to be so feisty. Shadow's eyes darkened. Yeah. Okay, I'll take a look! Eggman went over to Omega and turned him on. Rocket boosters are the best medicine. Apply acid two times a day. Shadow and Rouge shook their heads. Eggman opened the stomach hatch and quickly glared at them. Now how did this happen? I, uh, accidentally gave him coffee. Eggman facepalmed himself and pulled out Tails' temporary power source. Now this is just sad. I never got those muffins. Eggman then got up and returned with the required core. He fixed it back into Omega and closed him up. Now that should do the trick. Good thing I had a spare for my last model. Hello everyone. What did I miss? Oh no. Guys, are you selling me? I know, I'm not always the best. No, no, honey. We were just getting you a new core. We would never give you up. Precisely. You're a member of this team, Omega. You take that very seriously. Omega had a sizzle come out from his head, as if this forward emotion was shocking his system. Thank you. I love you guys, too. 
I, I never said I... Rouge put an arm around him. Just let him have this one. While this was happening, Eggman had snuck away and returned with a massive weapon. Ha <laughs> ha! Now I can take you and my robot back! Oh, I second thought it was nice doing business with you! <laughs> Good shot. Nice to have you back. Shadow and Rouge smiled at their friend as he put his arms around them. Shadow then took them home. Hey, Rouge. Yes? I'm kind of thirsty. I'm going to grab some more of that drink from this morning. No! no!